Hello everyone, welcome back. So we are in Riverview and we're gonna spend a couple days here, a couple videos. We're gonna play with little baby Gordon. I missed him oh so much. Oh god, his eyes look so creepy. Is Does he have like, like yellow? Oh yeah, I think they do actually get changed to yellow because I believe Aubrey has the same kind. Okay, I, did, I just didn't realize. So um, their wishes are reset because I ran into like some weird issue, but I fixed it by moving them out and then moving them back in here. So uh, yeah, I got to play around with this freaking um, balloon. I don't know what the deal with my frame rate is. It was like freaking out for a second. Let's go. Aubrey, how about you get in maybe with uh, Marco? Who knows? Hopefully it works. They just never want to get in at the same time for some reason They just hate spending time with each other in the balloon. They don't want to be trapped in the air for too long with each other Oh gosh, all right, let's go. I want to see how this works. Also, um, I but a few people wanted me to change Ellie's clothing I'm a little sad about that because I really love her style. This is my favorite sim out of like every series that I've done Although I say that I probably oh wait. No, don't move no, don't leave. Please don't leave, Marco. Oh, shoot. I was too late. Okay, get in. I wasn't paying attention. Uh, yeah, anyway, I say that, but, like, every time I create a new family, usually there's a sim in that family that I like more than the previous sim that I liked. Okay, Aubrey, I saw that. You- Oh, my gosh, Aubrey, what's the deal? Why must you do this to me? Marco, please stay here. Um, prepare for takeoff. Oh, stop. Marco, what is wrong with you? I don't know why they always do this. So yeah, I don't really want to change Ellie's clothing, but if that's something that you guys want, then prepare for takeoff. Please. Oh, you see this? Oh, this is a success. I've never had this happen before. I don't think my sims ever want to spend time with each other. Don't leave. No, don't land. Are you kidding me? What is wrong with you? I want to drink something and sightsee. Why are you going to land? Okay. Drink and sightsee. Jeez. This just is so stressful. <laughs> Look at how cute they are. Um, oh my gosh. What just happened to Aubrey? Uh, Aubrey, can you not freeze? <laughs> if it's not one thing... It's another. Okay, well, I guess Aubrey's just going to stay in this really awkward position with the fake bottle. Oh, here we go. Oh, yay. Sipping some bubbly. Marco's going to drink some, too. Some sparkling cider. Some apple cider. They look like they're enjoying themselves. Oh, he's putting... <laughs> oh, jeez. He's putting his arm around her. That's so adorable. They would make a cute couple, I, I must admit. Uh, Alright, so can we do a sightsee? Now they're sightseeing. I don't really want to fly to anywhere. I, just, uh, I keep moving it. Okay, well, I'm just going to let them be. I just really wanted to play with it for a second. Alright, Gordon has taken a liking to his generation's imaginary friend, which is fine. Uh, we want to teach him how to do things. Have I already taught him how to potty and stuff? Oh, I have! I guess it's time to age him up. I might do that in the next video, but... What I do want to do is, I think since Ellie has graduated and she hopefully is level 10 science, this is like the one time I actually want her to be level 10 science. Oh, that's fine. Can we get a DNA sample from ourselves or have I just gotten rid of them? DNA sample. Okay, are these from us? From Ellie Ryan. I... Emma, going to clone her. And if you haven't seen this before, it's pretty interesting. Oh, we can't clone. The interaction. Okay, fine. Research science, you big baby. We're going to research until our skill goes up, which shouldn't be too long because my sims gain skills like a freaking crazy. We have nowhere to put this. Can we put it in here? I gotta get a trash can. Well, I have like two trash cans, but... <clears throat> I don't know. Also, when I send them back to university, I want... Okay, good. She can now take a stab at cloning. Oh, gosh. That sounds lovely. Uh, let's clone from sample. After mastering element gene bonding manipulation... <laughs> I said that. So weird. Manipulation. <laughs> take a scientific sample. Okay. Bye. Um, and Gordon likes his new toy. I should put a light out here, actually. It's too dark. I never remember to put lights outside. Do you guys do that? I always do that for some reason. I just never put the lights outside. I gotta put them on the wall. I don't want to get like some ugly lamps. 
I just got this like um, tiki lamp from Nothing's At All. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> it like <laughs> is fire. So, it, well, look, holy moly, it does a great job at lighting everything up though. All right, Ellie, can we do this? Hopefully she doesn't like fail. We have one DNA sample left. I believe we can get our own DNA sample. No? How do you get your own DNA sample then? I think if I have Aubrey ask her for her DNA sample, I could just give it give it to her. <clears throat> what is this? From Otis. I gave everybody's like samples to Aubrey, by the way, if you didn't know. Oh yeah, we have another Forbidden Fruit. What's up with that? Ellie Ryan just created a clone of Ellie Ryan and it's the spitting image of the original specimen. Specimen? Oh my gosh, I cannot talk today. Specimen. Huzzah! Oh, look at Ellie's new baby! What should we call her? Her name is Ellie Ryan. Let's call her something cute. Um, I kind of want to call her Lori. I don't know. I really like that name. Lori. Such a pretty name. Let's go, Aubrey. I mean, Ellie. I'm terrible with um, remembering people's... Oh, great. Now i got to put up another... Uh, I'm going to decorate her room. I'm probably going to have to give her a smaller bed. Uh, yeah. I went with the totally cliche pink girly theme. <laughs> I didn't do too much changing around, but I did give her a smaller bed just so the, the little baby fits and I gave her a little pink potty and it doesn't match at all. Uh, this one matches the bed though, which is pretty cool. So, oh, look at her little baby. This is too cute. I'm really sad you can't take babies to university, but it kind of makes sense. Um, you know, your sims can't go streaking around. <laughs> I don't know. That would be really awkward because you're not allowed to, um, go skinny dipping and stuff with children in your house if you did not know that already. Oh, I also put in this cool walking thing so when she ages up, we can make her just learn it right away. And I think I just might age her up either in this, probably in the next video, I'll age both of the babies up. Little Gordon Hound, he's been a, he's been a toddler for what seems like ever. Um, he's sleeping with his eyes open. That's so cute. And look at his little imaginary friend. Oh my gosh. All right. So everybody is probably going to go to bed soon. Oh my goodness. They've been stuck up here this entire time. Um, can we please get down? Can we land? This is pretty bad. I don't want them to die up here. Look at it. Hungry and tired. Okay, fine, Marco. Let's go. Please don't be stuck. I'd be so upset. Aubrey, can you knock it off? Can we land? Okay, good. You need to go to sleep. Everybody needs to go to sleep. Uh, let's go. And then Otis, are you tired? Oh, you are tired. Let's go use the bathroom. And then you're going to have to go to sleep too. I forgot whose bed. I think this is his bed. And this is Marco's bed. I love Marco's bed sheets. Uh, I just like change. I don't know. I like to customize stuff, by the way. I got asked this if like some of these things were custom patterns. And no, they're not. I believe they're either from the base game or from like expansion packs and stuff packs and I just changed the colors around. I like to play with them a lot. And that's how I got like Ellie's style. It's all different. I spent a lot of time on her. <laughs> Especially with those stupid fishnets. I made, I put them up on the exchange by the way. I said I was going to put a, a link to them in a video before and I don't know if I did but I'll try to remember to put it in the description of this video. If I forget please comment and tell me so I can put them in there because a lot of people want them. But Keep in mind, you have to change the skin color of them. You could keep the color black, but you have to change the skin color to match your sim. That's the only thing. Uh, so anyway, Marco, you're going to go to bed. No, go to potty first, and then you can go to sleep. And little Ellie, she's sleeping. Everybody's, like, in the same mood lit thing, because when I had to move them out and move them back in, they all, like, got the same exact um, moods, moodlets. By the way, when is everybody going to work? I completely forgot they all have jobs. Otis is going to have to wake up to go to his job. Um, Ellie is not friendly with her boss, but it looks like they're all doing fairly well, except with their bosses. Marco, very disappointed. Probably not going to get this honorary degree thing. By the way, we have a ton of lifetime happiness points that I could probably waste on stuff. Let's go have Aubrey uh, waste them on some things. What else is there for university? I believe is a degree, honorary degree. Okay, I can just have Marco just completely get his lifetime wish fulfilled, but I don't really want to do that. I feel like it would be too cheaty for me. Teleportation pad, no. I don't think there's anything else that came with 
University, unfortunately. I do like getting these Dirt Defiant ones, and I think I might actually do that because she hasn't fulfilled her lifetime wish, so... Oh no, why did I get that? I don't even think she needs to take a shower. What a waste. <laughs> fine, that's fine. Uh, we'll get <laughs> Steel Bladder. She doesn't have to go to the bathroom. Oh my goodness, why didn't I? Well, I wasn't paying attention. She never gets hungry either. What the heck? What do we use for her? We can make her a green thumb. Why not? Um, long distance friend is really good, but of course I just wasted that. Unless that counts towards water, which would be amazing because then she wouldn't have to take so many showers. And water is in the place of um, the shower, the hygiene thing. And everybody's sleeping. I'm going to put on speed three to get them to wake their butts up. Although, Aubrey, why can't you go to sleep? What's wrong? Oh no, do I have to like reset her bed? I'm pretty sure I just have to get her a new bed and then put it back in. Does this happen to you guys? It does to me sometimes, especially with bunk beds. Uh, that seems to be a huge problem. Bunk beds, of course, originally came from generations, but I believe they've been putting them in Sims 3 store sets, which is amazing because bunk beds are like the world's greatest invention when it comes to Sims 3 and you have like no room in your house to do anything because your Sims just can't sleep anywhere. I don't know. Gordon is freaking, he's doing really well. Oh no, little baby Lori is gonna have to wake up. Um, I probably named a baby Lori before, but that's fine. I really like that name. Have I said that already? <laughs> I have. Let's go snuggle with her and play with her and snuggle and play. All is so cute. Mommy baby bonding, which we haven't really done. So sad. I put her I put her awards. You know you could sell these for like a thousand simoleons when you get them. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Look at how cute. Wait, where's her baby face? Oh Ellie, come on, I'm trying to like get a good view of the baby. Okay, let's go this way. I'm very bad at turning around <laughs> with the mouse. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. I love Ellie's hair. All right. Look at how adorable she is. She's going to grow up to look just like her mom, which is going to be, like, really awkward, I guess. But at the same time, it would be really cute. And this... Oh, it's our acquaintance. This isn't even considered our daughter. This must be a... This must be wrong. Is it? Is that weird? I could have sworn, like, when I did it in my current household, that they turned out to be our actual living son um, when I did it. It was a boy. That's so sad. Oh, sorry. I think that was my phone. My email. <laughs> Otis, what are you doing? You're sleeping about... You're dreaming about trophies, and Marco's dreaming about cookbooks. And now he's dreaming about um, microscopes. And now you're fishing in your dreams. So, Ellie, I guess I'm just going to, like, play with them until everybody wakes up, and then I will probably end it there, and then in the next video, we'll age up the babies and see what they look like, because we don't get to spend much time with them. Um, hopefully, we can at least age them up, make them go to university. Maybe I could have little baby Lori Ryan go to Island Paradise. I get asked uh, this question if I'm going to do an Island Paradise Let's Play. Of course I will. I'm so excited for Island Paradise. Are you guys? I'm excited for mermaids. I want to... I want to... Oh no, it's leisure day. It's seasons creeping up on me. Oh, I can't believe I haven't exited out of that. I don't know. I just want to make a mermaid. Oh, so bad. <laughs> Who's waking up right now? I think Otis? No. Ellie. Oh yeah, because she just went back to sleep. Okay, I'm going to put on speed 3. Uh, Otis is going to have to go to work soon, which is fine. He needs to. We need um, some money because I wasted 12,000 simoleons on a stupid balloon, which actually ended up working, which was not a complete fail. And at least we did get a clone of Ellie, Laurie and Ellie. All their names rhyme, kind of. Well, they actually, they totally do. Also, when we go back, did I? I don't remember if I said this, but we have to take the aptitude test too. Okay, Otis, before we leave, go do something something with this freaking machine where is it oh no is it in your inventory i'm gonna have to oh what i'm gonna have to buy another i believe it's um in our family inventory i keep going into this look at all this crap that we have uh where oh here we go we only have one i could have sworn otis had one in his inventory did everybody's inventory get totally wiped or did i just leave it somewhere I probably left it somewhere. Okay, so what we want to do, find test subject. I guess we'll do, I guess we'll do a test subject. 
um, personality programming of Aubrey Hound because she's awake and I see her walking around somewhere. Oh, she's reading. That's cool. Okay, Aubrey, we're gonna change your personality. I think that's traits. She's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Uh, I have to change her hair back too. I keep forgetting. I keep getting um, reminded to change Aubrey's hair back, but I just can't seem to remember to do it. Oh my gosh. Uh, Ellie has just improved her athletic skill. Why? Why are you working out? That should be Marco up there working out. Has he even gotten level? Has oh, am I missing it? Oh no, athletic is right here. Mastered. Okay, Otis. What are you doing? Aubrey looks scared out of her freaking mind. Uh, let's go change something. What do we want to change? Perfectionist and green thumb. Neat? No, I like neat. Let's change eco-friendly. <laughs> Actually, no, I kind of like eco-friendly because then she... Nah, whatever. Let's get something different. Let's get unlucky so that she never dies. I like this idea. I don't know if I have an unlucky sim, but let's just change it anyway. We could change her name, which I don't really want to do. <laughs> Woman, what are you doing getting in my way? Cool. Did it work? Oh, looks like a success. Otis did a little a little dance. New identity. Free living is about the freedom to start over. Aubrey rewrote her personality, name, and passed through arcane technology. Okay, so I will end it there. In the next video, we will pick up where we left off. Um... Uh, age the babies up as i as i've said like a million times already oh my gosh and then i i don't know what else should we do while we're here in riverview is there anything special that you guys would like me to do because we don't get to come here that often and poor babies are going to be like so lonely without us they're going to be taken care of for like two weeks with the babysitter oh it'd be so annoying to be taken care of uh, for, with a babysitter what that sounds so weird saying it like that uh Okay, I'm gonna go. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will talk to you all on Wednesday. Bye, everyone.